Hello again, welcome back. A first for me tonight. Well, most of them are firsts, but this is a beer from China. And it's from my Beer 52 June box. And this, I think it's a collaboration with a, a Dutch or Belgian brewery. And it's called Citra and Mosaic IPA with Yuzu. Yuzu is a citrus fruit. It's 4.2% ABV. Uh, Mosaic and Citra Yuzu IPA. Originating from central China, this lumpy little orange adds citrusy abundance to the medley of berry aromas imbued by the Mosaic and Citra hops in this IBA, IPA. Looks good. So and it's from Dong Feng Brewing. Inspired by the Red Dragon. I have been in China in Haiku. The city was called Haiku. It was Hainan province in the South China Sea. It's an island province. And we went... We, we were based there. We went up to Beijing. We flew... I think that had been, What was it? 12 flights in 16 days <laughs> and went to Beijing and I went to a brew pub there and I had a porter that the, the brew it themselves, a brew pub obviously, one of the best I've ever tasted and I tried, wherever I go I try the local beers and it was still like lager beers mostly but it was, they were okay. <laughs> so this is another Chinese beer So I'm looking forward to this one. Uh, let's uh, crack it open and see how it pours. So what's a, a slight haze to that. It's a pale gold on the floor. Looks like a lovely colour. I've obviously abandoned that new technique of just putting a third of the beer in. I think I've done it in one video. Anyway, yeah, there's a slight haze to that, some uh, slow rising bubbles, but a pinky of white 
creamy foam. Let's a wee swirl. That puts an absolutely beautiful creamy head on it. Yeah, big citrus hits. That's it's mainly citrusy. So it must be the yuzu. It smells really nice. Cheers, my dears. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Mild carbonation, and then that releases a bit of a juice bomb, a citrus juice bomb. And then there's a slight bitterness along the, the edge of the tongue and at the back, and then it's gone. I'm not getting much maltiness. But that is very nice indeed. Let's go through the tasting sheet from craftbeer.com and we'll do the colour first. So that's pretty pale, that. it's been a two or a three. What's that? Light yellow to straw, something like that. I'll do the wee, the wee uh, light test. I don't know if it's a wasted time or not. It does show the, 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 the colours though. That's it, be nothing, and that's it through the beer, and at the bottom of the beer. It just shows up the colours. The camera, it might be exaggerated on the camera, but it is a two or three, something like that. The clarity has got a slight haze on it. Colour of foam head retention is, I'll say, moderate. The foam texture is thin. Visual carbonation is slow. The alcohol aroma, I can never smell that, so it's not detectable. The hops is citrus. It smells incredibly fresh, it's absolutely beautiful. Fruity. The malt, I'll say bready, but you're not getting a great deal. White breadish, you know. The esters. I don't know if I'm getting some pineapple there. It's a cross between pineapple and banana, if that makes any sense. The flavour and aftertaste, alcohol, not really detectable. The hot flavour is big, citrus hits. Am I getting much pininess? There is a bit actually. That is gorgeous. I'll say a, a bit piney raisinous. It is fruity as well. It's absolutely gorgeous. The hot bitterness is fairly restrained. The malt flavour is bready, white bread. Malt sweetness low. The palate astringency is low. The body is quite drying. Yeah, it's like a medium body, but it's it's fairly dry, drying to soft, sort of a halfway between. The palate carbonation is low, there is a wee bit and then it releases all the flavours, just the right amount. The length finish is moderate, a eh, medium, 15 to 60 seconds. It's no hanging around. There is a bit of fruitiness at the back there. Balance and drinkability desirable, style appropriate. So, what is untapped, say? Uh, so, it's called Mosaic and Citra Yuzu IPA from Dong Feng Brewing. And it's the style is IPA International. Uh, one check in from a friend, we give it 4.5, which I think is about right. Everyone else, 3,980 check-ins with an average of 3.59, which is fairly high for the untapped. Uh, so Dongfeng Brewing, uh, it's a microbrewery in China, it doesn't say which area. And it's a collaboration with uh, De Proof Brewery uh, in 
Vlaanderen, Belgium. Belgium. Vlaanderen, I wonder if that's Flanders. Loch Christie, Vlaanderen. So, the style guide details originating from central China, the yuzu adds citrusy abundance to the medley of berry aromas imbued by the mosaic and citra hops in this IPA. Descriptors are is citrusy, light, orange, yuzu, banana. Yeah, so there is that. Yeah, berries. I don't know what kind of berries they mean. No, unless it's like gooseberry. There is a, maybe a very slight gooseberry. You know that tart gooseberry? It is a really nice beer. I'm going to give that 9.2 out of 10. It's a very good beer. It's really nice. It's it's quite light and crisp and refreshing and fully flavour. They're not an overpowering, it's just really well balanced beer. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Hopefully. Ta ta for now. Cheers, my dears. Thumbs up.